hello guys kd here so in today's video i'm going to show you how you can make this very small 12 volt 10 amp switch mode power supply with uh, uc3843 ic so let's start the video so guys here is the pcb of the project as you can see the size is very small So now let's mount the components and solder them. So guys now you need a powerful N channel MOSFET So here I am using 10N60 N channel MOSFET and a STPS2045CT dual short key diode So solder them also So guys I have attached a heatsink with the MOSFET and the diode So now let's wind the transformer so here I am using ETD 34 or 35 with an air gap of 0.8 mm so first let's wind the primary so first we will wind half of the primary so for the primary I am using 0.45 mm copper wire so this is the starting point so wind 18 turns in clockwise direction so now for the secondary I am using 10 0.45 mm copper wire in parallel so this is the starting point so wind 4 turns in clockwise direction so now let's wind the rest of the primary so this is the starting point so wind 19 turns in clockwise direction so now let's wind the auxiliary winding so this is the starting point so wind 6 turns in clockwise direction so for the air gap I am using 0.8 mm piece of paper so cut it in pieces and put it between the pores like this so guys our transformer is now ready so now put this in the PCB and solder it so now you need this UC3843AN IC so Put this in the PCB in the correct direction. So guys our circuit is now ready. So now let's test it. So now let's turn on the circuit. So as you can see the output voltage is 13.4 volts. So the output voltage is adjustable. You can change the output voltage using this potentiometer. So the minimum voltage is around 9.75 volts and the maximum voltage is 13.4 volts. So now let's check the circuit with a load. So I have connected both my multimeters with the circuit. So this one will show the output voltage and this one will show the output current. So now let's turn on the circuit. So the output voltage is 12.69 volts. So now let's put some load. So at 4.2 amps the output voltage drops to 12.39.
at uh, 7.5 amps the output voltage is 12.2 so now let's increase it to 10 amps so at around 10 amps of current the output voltage is 12 volts as you can see 11.8 volts at 10.5 amps so as you can see the power supply is working fine and uh, the heatsink is a bit hot i'll recommend you to use a big heatsink if you want to use it at full current so guys this was my today's video so if you like this video then please like subscribe and share with your friends and if you have any question regarding this circuit then you can ask me in the comments so thanks for watching